Today, we're going to go over the Sea-Doo Switch mooring cover. It's about $900. Um, not sure it's worth it. Uh, we'll see. The instructions are very vague. First off, you have four of these. They wrap around the bottom of the bar. These are for hooks for your top. Then you take out the bolts that are here and put the extensions for these rubber bands to hold it. Two in the front on each side and two in the back. Uh, these straps go around the cleat like that. These have a clip. This clip goes to the inside of the bar, push it in and then use this to pull. So push it in, pull down, and it locks. As you see, some of them don't lock very well. If you're gonna leave the bimini up, you open these up, just wrap it around. Very common for most bones. Now the rear strap, just like that, goes around to the two additional straps here problem. If you're at the dock with a mooring cover, you're at, you cannot reach the far side of the boat to clamp them down. You can't do it from inside. There are expansions. So you see this line? There's also another one here. If you fold the bimini down, which I tried first, there's no possible way for this to fit. This is just an expansion. So you pop these Velcro, loosen this up. As you see, it gives you about a foot extension on the cover. So when the top is down, the cover will fit. I'll try that next. Because leaving the cover up full time in the sun, the bimini is not a good idea, it won't last. I did that on my last boat. One concern, it does not cover your plastic sides. I am concerned about how the sun's going to treat those. I wish it covered the sides, keep the sun out of the boat, keep the heat out, and also say the floor or anything else, a cooler that you'd have in there. I bought these little extensions off Amazon to keep the tie down for the um, pads for the boat. But that's how the mooring cover works. So it says Sea Dew, that means the back side. The Sea Dew logo is on the front side. Again, instructions are not very good. Uh, I've also installed the 27 group battery in the storage. I've got some pictures of that and uh, I'll post those too. But for $900, I mean, it looks okay. The poles are very flimsy inside there. I don't expect them to last the whole summer. Um, I think the better goal would be to keep it with the top down. Uh, that way you'd have less um, bow within the cover. But the way it is today, I don't think rain will settle too much on it or water. It's fairly firm, but it's also brand new. So if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, See you switch owners on Facebook group. Thank you.